Two years ago, Lori Jo Bennett was a school teacher. Today, she is the co-owner of an award-winning canning business. It all started as a hobby following her grandmother's recipes at Colquitt County's local canning plant. I would go there and maybe pick 50 gallons, not 50 gallons, 55 gallon buckets at a time of tomatoes and go there and make my own salsa, spaghetti sauce, um, Brunswick stew, vegetable soup, and I would go and give it away. Their products are sold across the country and the world, but Lori Jo's heart stays in South Georgia. The cannery grows some of their own produce and uses as much local as possible. Certain times of the year we'll have to get stuff sent in, but uh, most everything, if we don't grow it, it's grown right here close. By constantly stirring and flipping the cans, as they just finished doing behind me, it ensures the seeds are spread evenly through the jar. They are a licensed co-packer and will use that same care to make your recipes. You could bring your recipe in if you wanted to market it. We would go through the process of cooking it for you, helping you get your um, analysis on the product so that you can put it on as a shelf stable product to sell. Lori Jo needed a sign before quitting her teaching job. Shelves full of awards later, she's glad she made the switch. It was two days after we had the labels on our first jar, they won Best of the National Gourmet Food Show in Atlanta. Despite success, Lori Jo's Southern style canning still cans everything by hand and will never go to an assembly line process. Because the, the taste just isn't the same. Stay connected to this story at MySouthwestGA.com. Melanie Kendall, Fox 31 News.